These are the screen's greatest masters of espionage, whether or not they pack a license to kill. Do I make you horny, baby? Yeah, do I? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 greatest movie spies. When we have finished with you, you will no longer be David Webb. I'll be whoever you need me to be, sir. Number 10, Derek Flint, Our Man Flint. Very well, gentlemen, uh, Derek Flint. <laughs> Kicking off our list is America's answer to Britain's James Bond. Portrayed by James Coburn, this master spy is charged with stopping a trio of mad scientists from blackmailing the world with their powerful weather-altering machine. We are now able to control local weather conditions throughout the world. While his skills and shenanigans may be a tad over the top, he intrigues us with his use of private spy codes and his refusal to use standard weapons. <laughs> Number 9, Austin Powers, The Austin Powers Trilogy. Speaking of over the top, this international man of mystery is a 60s super spy who ends up in the 90s after being cryogenically frozen. You've been cryogenically frozen for 30 years. Who are these people? This James Bond spoof is both hilarious and unique as a spy since he showcases his appreciation for free love. Yeah, that's spot, all right. That's the spot right there. A stylish fashion sense, bad teeth, and excess mojo. I just didn't want to fall in love again, and I thought you'd never love me without my mojo. There are few things this exceptionally hairy spy won't do to stop Dr. Evil. Number 8, Nikita, La Femme Nikita. Okay, now we're getting serious. Next up is the film heroine whose death is faked by a shadowy French government organization so she can fully assume an alternate identity. Officiellement, vous êtes décédé samedi à 17h. C'est le médecin de la prison centrale qui a constaté votre suicide provoqué par une injection massive de tranquillisant. Transformed from a drug addict, robber, and cop killer to spy and assassin, she accepts missions against her will. Nikita is rare in the spy world since she was forced into servitude, but she uses her newly acquired skills to regain her freedom. Number 7, Sam Ronan. Played by Robert De Niro, this former CIA agent and Cold War spy will stop at nothing to keep a mysterious briefcase away from the Russian government. Relentlessly paranoid and quick with witty comebacks, Sam's job is to keep his eyes on the prize. Why the Russians? Why not you? If we had the money to buy the case, we wouldn't have hired you to steal it. His greatest distinguishing feature is that he doesn't believe in self-doubt or in entering a location from which he can't escape. You stupid shite. You're a dead man. Number 6. Jack Ryan, The Jack Ryan Film Series. Damn cook! A stuffy tough Pekoya. Starting as a simple covert CIA analyst, this intelligence gatherer distinguishes himself from the tuxedo wearing and physically imposing spies with his unmatched ability to piece things together. Oh, come on. You're just an analyst. What can you possibly know what goes on in this mine? I know Ramius, General. A Tom Clancy staple, this character has been portrayed by several actors on the big screen, including Alec Baldwin, Harrison Ford, and Ben Affleck. We have to prove that it wasn't the Russians before he's convinced it is. What defines him is that with each appearance, he climbs another rung of the espionage ladder. Good morning. I'd like to see Ernesto Escobedo. I don't have an appointment. Number five, Brian Mills, Taken. I don't know who you are. I don't know what you want. If you are looking for a ransom, I can tell you I don't have money. This standout on our list is a retired CIA operative who doesn't take kindly to the abduction of his family members. A spy with exceptional terrorist tracking skills, he makes use of a finely tuned memory for sights and sounds and can learn what he needs from minute details. But what I do have are a very particular set of skills. Skills I have acquired over a very long career. Skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. Deadly and amoral, he has no problem resorting to torture. So when he threatens you, you better listen. I don't have any more time to waste. Marco from Tropoya. 
You either give me what I need or this switch will stay on until they turn the power off for lack of payment on the bill. Number four, Harry Tasker, True Lies. Have you ever killed anyone? Yeah, but they were all bad. Didn't expect to see Arnie here? Well, he's only pretending to be a boring computer salesman. In reality, he's leading a double life as a spy for the U.S. Counterterrorism Task Force, which means he's actually a well-traveled agent who can tango, speak foreign languages, ride a horse, and even pilot a jet fighter. But unlike others on this list, he always takes the time to apologize to bystanders. Sorry. Number three. Ethan Hunt, the Mission Impossible series. This spy is a point man and senior field operations agent for an elite top secret espionage and covert operations agency called the IMF, or if you prefer, the Impossible Missions Force. He'll tackle the missions others deem crazy or flat out impossible. And that requires a mastery of rubber disguises, stealth, martial arts training, the power to dangle from ceilings and buildings, and the ability to run really fast. Number two, Jason Bourne, The Bourne Identity Trilogy. Under his true name David Webb, this spy was captain of the Army Special Forces when he volunteered for a top-secret CIA program that used behavioral modification to make him the ultimate unquestioning agent, spy, and assassin. A specialist in martial arts, firearms, and explosives, he can also fluently speak countless languages and is incredibly resourceful. Unfortunately, a case of amnesia makes him a liability. Number 1. James Bond, The James Bond Series Was there ever any doubt? Taking the top spot on our list is the double-O agent with a license to kill who loves shaken martinis, outlandish gadgets, sports cars, and beautiful women. I like married women, don't you, James? The ultimate spy, Bond's style is only matched by his love of queen and country and his ludicrous villains. Strangely, he isn't shy about sharing his true identity with everyone he meets. How does that work exactly? Thank you, mister. The name's Bond. James Bond. Do you agree with our list? I will find you. And I will kill you. Who's your favorite movie spy? For more entertaining top 10s, be sure to subscribe to watchmojo.com. Here, cool off.